My name is Rebecca, but you can call me Becky and welcome to my channel. If you've been here before, then welcome back. Today I am going to be doing an e.l.f. Cosmetics unboxing haul. I didn't buy much from e.l.f. Cosmetics, but considering that I don't buy makeup that much, this box is a lot for me. Um, and I bought some e.l.f. Cosmetics on Cyber Monday. Yeah, not Black Friday on Cyber Monday is when I got their stuff. I think they had a lot of stuff like 60% off if you bought it over a certain amount, free shipping and a bunch of other stuff. So I ended up saving quite a bit of money. Um, and then I was able to try out some stuff that I kind of wanted to buy before but I didn't want to spend money on if I didn't know I was gonna like it. So, yeah. Oh, and I'm wearing, um, I think my mom got me this Christmas sweater. One of the, Hi, Amy. Where are you? You're over here. Hi. Do you want to say hi? Say hello. Mwah. <laughs> um, my mom got this for me a couple Christmases ago, I think. It's a black kitty wearing a Santa hat. I love it. I love Christmas sweaters. I ask for them every year. First up, I got this. Oh, the three piece lip balm set. So I really like their, it's like a chapstick, but tinted, but it's like a really thick chapstick. Um, and I really like it. The one that I have, I think it's called something berry. It almost has like a pepperminty feel to it, which I love. So there's three of them here. This looks like the kind that I get normally. So, nah, I gotta do it like this. So that's what it looks like. So that's the first one that I got. I got three different colors. Um, I got this one. That's more of like a rosy. And then this one looks bright red. Wow, the, let me see here. Yep, that's a red, all right. So, I feel like these would make really good stocking stuffers. So I got them as stocking stuffers for myself. <laughs> I can be such a dork. Okay. So that's what I got. So they look like this. Okay. Yeah. Oh, I'm trying to put it back neatly in the box without crushing it. So that's the first thing. The thing that I got is Wrinkle Refiner. Smooth, soften appearance of laugh lines, crow's feet, wrinkles with this rich, with this formula rich with wheat protein, horse chestnut, green tea, Edelweiss, chamomile, shea, mango, and antioxidants for a rejuvenated and youthful look. Apply to desired area prior to foundation, concealers, and powders. Gently pat and blend in. Reapply throughout the day as needed over your makeup. I guess it looks like a stick, like that. So, let's see what it actually looks like. Yeah. Okay. Hi, Lando. Do you want to see what this is? No, you're going to go in the box of stuff. Okay. Wow. 
How does it work? I feel like I'm breaking it. It just keeps clicking. How do I make it go out? Do you know how to use this? How do you use it? How? 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 Okay. So, next up. Oh, my concealer stick. So I have a concealer stick or a concealer that I really like, um, but I wanted to try something new that was a little bit less pricey and one that I can get like at a department store or whatever or online from this place. And the one that I get now, I get at Thrive Market um, and I don't buy from Thrive too much unless if like I have a large order going in because I'm one of the people that does not like to pay for shipping. I will buy extra stuff to avoid paying shipping. I don't understand it really, but yeah. <laughs> so I want to try different concealer stick. Um, one that I can easily get anywhere and doesn't cost as much. So I got this one. This is really nice. And then it actually turns up. So. I like it. I like that it's um, like really light, so it's not gonna be like a super heavy concealer. Because I like concealing my under eyes, which you can't tell in the video, or maybe you can, and, and I just did a bad job at putting my concealer on. But I put concealer under my eyes every day, because I just have horrible bags under my eyes. Like, sometimes it looks like I got into a bar fight overnight, and I have these really deep, dark circles. Um, but I really like my freckles, and I like my other, like, I guess, what some people would call imperfections on their face. And the only thing that I want to cover up is the under eye circles, but my freckles go like right under my eyes as well. Like they go like right across here like this. So sometimes the concealer, like when you like blend it in, it goes over the top of the freckles and then it makes me sad because then I can't see them. So I've always tried finding lightweight concealer ones. Or, you know, like lighter concealer. Illuminating Primer Mist. Why did I get this? Okay, well, it's for a primer. You can use it after makeup to like set the makeup. You can use it throughout the day to refresh. And I think I got it so that way, um, to like help moisten my face because it gets really dry here and I've been having problems with eczema and I don't know if it will help or add to the problem. Hoping that it'll help the problem. So it looks like this. Let's see how well it works. Well, ooh. Oh, that feels, oh, that feels nice and cool. This is gonna be amazing. Ooh, can't really tell the difference with my hand, but I can in person. And it feels like I just like put on some lotion that's like completely soaked into my skin. Like it feels really nice. Okay. Next, oh yes. Okay, so this is one that I was really excited for. I've been looking for a scrub for my face and I keep wanting to buy the one from Young Living because it has like peppermint and stuff in it. But it's always sold out, all the time, always always and forever it will be sold out so 
I just decided to get this. And I'm really excited to try it. So this is made with, and let's see here, it has stuff like walnut, apricot, um, water, obviously. So it says, treat your skin to this gentle exfoliating scrub to help buff and polish away dead skin cells for a glowing and healthy looking skin. Infused with purified water and vitamin E, our rich hydration formula leaves skin feeling smooth and looking luminous. So I am very excited to try this. Another thing that I got here is the um, acne fighting spot gel. So basically it has aloe in it, tea tree oil, witch hazel, um, and some other stuff and you can just roll it on to like red spots as you get them and I feel like this helps out a lot I also really like the spot acne spot treatment from Young Living um, I like both of them I just was running out of this one so I decided to get this one as well oh, and a bronzer So I don't use bronzer that much, um, but I wanted to try it out. Maybe even if I don't try it like in the winter time, it's still, I wanted to try it out really for vacation, but the order came in too late. So, and I've already been back. <laughs> um, but. I wanted something that wasn't like super sparkly because a lot of bronzers have a lot of like glitter in them um, and I wanted something that didn't have that much glitter in it. So I got this. Oh and it's nice and light too, it doesn't, I like that. Next up, we have, oh, this is one that I really wanted for vacation too. <laughs> oh well. So I wanted a multi-stick. So this you can use for like um, your eye makeup, like an eyeshadow. You can use it for a lipstick. You can use it for a blush, like put a little bit on your cheeks. It, really great for everything. So this is what it looks like. Okay, so this is this versatile multi-stick can be used on your eyes, lips, and cheeks for a soft, glowy, monochromatic look. Use the shimmery, luxurious, blendable cream to powder stick as your eyeshadow, lipstick, and blush for a cohesive, hi, for a cohesive monochromatic look. This lightweight blendable formula makes it virtually mistake proof and perfect for touch-ups on the go. And wow, it's really tiny, look at it. So it looks like perfect for fitting in your purse on the go. Does it have a smell to it? No, it has no smell. So it rolls out. So like that. Let's see what it roll back in. Yes. Okay. Well, that's exciting. Okay, I got more mascara because mine is starting to get old. It still works great, but this is the mascara that I use. Um, what I do is I like adding a little drop of lavender to it and it makes it smell great. Um, it's also supposed to help with like your lash health or make your lashes longer, I guess. I don't know, but I like using this. Um, so it's waterproof 
I think I bought, I bought, I better bought the water waterproof. No, I can't talk. I better have bought the waterproof. So yes, this is the waterproof length and volume. So this is the one that I get all the time. And I like it a lot. The reason why I get waterproof is because I use eye drops a lot because I have allergies. Plus there's the dry weather here and I just need to use eye drops. Uh, so um, this helps it so that way like if I use other brands of mascara or other mascaras that are not waterproof and I put the eye drops in my eye like the mascara will run well it'll run below the eye and it'll also run into my eye and that burns so much so I always get waterproof and this is the mascara that I always use I like it now I don't use eyeliner that much um, because it always smears and I never thought about trying a waterproof eyeliner I just never have so I got a waterproof eyeliner pencil it comes in this box here it's from active and it's this small and then I think it twists up so you don't have to oh no I think you do have to sharpen it whoa what what's happening okay don't pull off the bottom piece it's not a sharpener <laughs> it is there for looks okay so this one you do have to sharpen and I don't have a sharpener because I don't use eyeliner so I'll have to get one then I also got this eye makeup remover balm so I have I wanted this for the vacation reason being is because I have a homemade eye makeup remover with like coconut oil some lavender oil carrot seed oil um, copaiba oil and there's some other stuff in there I'll make a post on makeup remover later if I haven't already um, but that's very difficult to take with you especially in warm climates where the coconut oil is going to melt and it's going to seep out of the edges of the jar so I wanted a like eye makeup remover stick so I got this And it just it scrolls up like that and then you basically are just supposed to rub this on your eye and then you rub it in and then you wipe it off easy peasy lemon squeezy is what it's supposed to be let's see if it is that so this eye makeup remover Stick gently dissolves eye makeup upon contact. This easy glide balm formula gently dissolves even long wear mascara. Convenient size stick is ideal for travel. Enriched with antioxidants to nourish and hydrate the skin. Directions. On dry skin, gently glide balm over lidded lashes. Massage with fingertips and then rinse with warm water. So it's really supposed to be that easy all this stuff that I got for vacation it's okay we're probably going to be going to Tucson later so now I've got the stuff another thing that I really wanted for vacation but I didn't get okay if I would have paid for the shipping I would have gotten it but you know me it's a rose gold travel kit. Look how cute that brush is. I mostly got it just for the brushes. Look how cute they are. I'm gonna open it. If it will open. So 
So I don't know if you can tell how gorgeous this rose gold color is. I love it. So you have the little mini eyeshadow brush. Then I have the um, concealer blush or concealer brush here. Okay. And then I have the, um, and they'll come with like these things to help you travel too. And then I have the highlighting brush. And then I have the blush brush. I'm so excited. These look so nice. Here. I really like these. The Rose Gold Lip Vault. They have 10 matte lip colors in here. So there is Natural, Tea Rose, Praline, Dash of Pink, Rowdy Rouge, Rich Red, Wine, Mulberry Haven, Berry Sorbet, and Scarlet Night. I really want to just use these now, and I don't want to wait. Is that bad? I was gonna wrap it and put it under the tree as a Christmas present for myself. I'm gonna use it now. Okay, so I'm not for sure if I finished. Um, I don't think that I showed you guys what the actual lipsticks in the matte lip vault look like so I'm gonna show you that now mm. it's gonna be natural one and they look just like this too That's what they look like. They're gorgeous. This is what they look like. In there. And I just pulled out the Scarlet Night. That's what they look like. And they can roll up and roll back down. Alright. Well, if you enjoyed this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Um, don't forget to subscribe so that way you get notified when I post more videos. And I will see you in a few days for the next Christmas vlog.